Hello Raider Nation, this is Duntoff. Today I'm at the Raiders headquarters, also known as the Intermountain Healthcare Performance Center. So this is out in Henderson, Nevada, right on Raiders Way. So today is March Saturday, March 27th, 2021. So I actually stopped out here. Well, I haven't really filmed out here in a while, but someone on my Instagram page, Aiden from Australia, he was asking me about the construction that they're starting to do out here for Mark Davis. I don't know, I'm sure you've heard that he bought the WNBA team, the Las Vegas Aces. So he messaged me and asked if I could come out here and show where they're going to be building. They're building the headquarters for their for the Aces as well as the practice facility. It's next to this uh, headquarters here. It's actually on. I'm on the. This is the south end. So they're actually building on the north end. So I'm going to head over there and we're going to check that out. But figured I'd start over here. If you remember watching all my updates at the headquarters, I'd always zoom in and show the stadium from here. So we're going to check that out. It's a nice clear day. Right now it's about 65 degrees. We've got a little breeze going on up here. Seems like it's always a little windier up here in Henderson than it is in town in Las Vegas. But we're going to zoom in. This is about 12 miles north of here. So there you can see Mandalay Bay. And then I'm gonna zoom, pan over. And there she is. So let's zoom in a little more. All right, so this side here, you can see where it says Allegiant Stadium. Sorry for the shake, just cause I'm zoomed in so far, but that's where the media mesh is, the prism view. If you saw my last video of the stadium, they are doing improvements to it. I think they're trying to clean it up a little, just the way it just didn't look as finished, you know, as the rest of the stadium did. So it's supposed to be about a 10 week project. They're gonna reconfigure it somehow don't know exactly what they're gonna do but I'm sure just clean it up so that keep watching my videos for updates on that also but there you go let me zoom in as far as I can all right you can see all the radiant heat coming up off the ground there we are supposed to get up Monday is gonna be close to 85 degrees out here again so it's it's gonna warm up. All right, so let's zoom out. Yeah, we're getting a big breeze here right now. So there you go. So once that screen is finally done, when we zoom in like that, we should be able to see it. All right, they're starting to do a lot of, build a lot more stuff out here. So if we look behind, all right, you got the practice facility here. And then we pan around to behind the building here. This would be west of the building. You can see they, a lot of the ground there is all leveled out. Because for this facility, they still have, I think it's another 20 acres or so. I could be wrong, but I know they have more acreage. They said they could put like more buildings and I even thought I heard one time they might even put like a small hotel. So there will be more added to this in the future. Then if we swing around to the back, you can see this, that white and blue building there, that is some kind of Amazon delivery building. I don't know if that's where the delivery vans go to pick up orders for the day. That's new. And then you can see over here, they're starting to work on some other, I think they're gonna just be more office buildings or like warehouses. 
And then I'm gonna swing around. So follow me on Instagram. I just announced yesterday like where to make your reservations for the new Raiders. The new Raiders uh, tavern and and restaurant. So you can see here, that's the M Resort. That is on St. Rose Parkway and Las Vegas Boulevard. If you're on the 15 coming in from California, that's the first uh, exit, the St. Rose exit. So they have the new Raiders Tavern and Grill opening up next. It opens up next Thursday, April 1st to the public. And if you want to make a reservation there, they are taking them now. You could go to opentable.com and just look up Las Vegas and then type in Raiders and the Raiders Tavern will pop up. So when I check last, it like tells you how many people have booked reservations already and it was going quick. They just started making the reservations yesterday. So if you're going to be coming to town and you want to get in, I think it'll have a pretty high demand. Because we're still at 50% uh, occupancy for restaurants. So I would go to opentable.com and make a reservation. So when I go there, I will film the place and show it on a video. So next week, look for that. All right, I'm going to go to the east side along Raiders Way and get some views from the front. And then we'll check out that new area where they're going to be building the Mark Davis's new team, the WNBA, Las Vegas Aces. Okay, I'm now on the east side. So this would be the southeast corner. I'm across the street. These vehicles are on Raiders Way. This is a pretty cool looking building. You know it's Raiders even without all the signage on the building. I haven't heard when they are gonna like open up to the public, the front area, because they are supposed to have a Raiders image inside here. So, Hopefully the restrictions start lifting up sooner than later and we'll be able to at least go in the front part and check that out. Alright, if I swing around here, this, I'm right by, they call the South Entry. This is where the employees and players and everyone come in. Right there. So that you can see they got the security booth where they'll come out and think they still do the temperature checks and then that gets you into the employee lot if you look back in the background there you can see some of the grass back there what's it say i can't read it right now oh, on street parking all right so the field area, remember there's three outdoor fields, full size fields, and then inside the field house area they have a full field and then a 50 yard, so field and a half inside there. All right, as I'm looking in the front, I could see the three flagpoles, but they don't have any flags up today. Not sure why. And then as I drove by today, well, let's see if we could see who's driving this. Might be someone famous. Can't make it out on here. Well, let's see what they do with the check here. If security up, oh, security still comes out. You can see a temperature check. We'll see after we download it if it was anyone we could recognize. All right, but uh, as I was driving by, we drove past the front of it. I'm gonna walk that way, but the torch was not on also. So let's head that way, check that out. 
and then on the other side there you can see them five big palm trees that's the area where the new uh, Aces headquarters is gonna be all right here's the straight-on shot of the headquarters we can see the original L. Davis Memorial Torch. The flame is not burning right now. I've been by this a few times where they actually have the flame on, but as you can see, they don't keep it on all the time. If you go on the stadium tour, or if you remember, they used to let people sign the sides of the torch. They have some of them on display right by the new torch so you can see the signatures and the way they have the new place the new torch at the stadium they actually have special plaque area around the base of it that's behind glass and they'll they have people sign that stuff all right if we pan over to the right over here this is the area that they're going to be building the new ACES headquarters and practice facility. And then if we look all the way over, well, we'll look at the sign because it's kind of in the way here. You got this yellow for lease sign. So you can see it's Matter Park. So Matter Park, if you look behind that, you can see the Raiderettes. That's their... Uh, studio where they're going to practice so this is phase two so it's going to be i guess this new building will be pretty much just a continuation of all those warehouse buildings there and they'll make part of it the training facility and headquarters and offices so let me walk down a little bit more we'll see if we could see anything going on Okay, here's the northeast view of the headquarters. I'm gonna pan over to the right and this will be the Mark Davis's new team, the Las Vegas Aces. He actually bought that MGM International, the ones that owns MGM and Bellagio and all that stuff. They owned, they're the ones that own the team before him so from what I read was he was talking to the main guy at MGM about paying the ladies more you know to bring them up more towards like how much the men make or something and that guy told him to why don't you buy the team then you could pay him whatever you want and that's what started the conversation Got some guys here, you can see they just pulled over to take some photos with the headquarters in the background. All right, but here's where they're gonna start building. I'm not sure, I think a lot of these type of buildings, they I could be totally wrong here, but I know a lot of these buildings, these big warehouses, they'll lay out the forms and pour the concrete and they actually lift the sides of the buildings up. So I would think it's going to be the same way. But you can see it's for Saturday, they have a few people on site working right now. And then from what I heard or read, so right now the Aces, they play at the Mandalay Bay. There's an event center there. That's where they play their games. But from what I read, Mark Davis would like to get them their own 
arena to play basketball in also he wants to well that is one of the premier teams in the league they were in the finals last season they did not win I don't know who they played though I don't have to say I don't really watch it but I know they were in the finals so so all right so here we go we got the Raiders here obviously then we're gonna have Mark Davis's um, Las Vegas Aces here and then if we swing all the way over next to that is also the Raiderettes training I mean, studio their practice studio so and there's that there and it's on Raiders way so Henderson is you know getting the Raiders 100% you know everything for them and then of course the stadium you can't see it from here it's back back that way behind the, those buildings there so the Raiders are hooked up here all right Raider Nation so thanks for watching if you're not subscribed please subscribe to my channel Raiders 1967 and then also if you could follow me on Instagram I post a lot of pictures and just little stuff on there so follow me on Instagram at Duntov67 so thanks for watching stay safe and I'll talk with you guys next time